Hey, what is up, you guys? It is Ivor Verse, and welcome back to another episode of Knights and Dragons. Today, it is time for yet again another heroic mode episode. Uh, gotta be kind of careful with my throat because um, I woke up this morning, I had such a dry throat, and I, I, I've I'm feeling it throughout the entire day. Tomorrow, you guys will be getting another Bronze to Epic episode. So make sure you guys look forward to that. That's going to be really cool. You guys have been requesting it like mad. So I'm like, okay, let's go ahead and do it in between Heroic Mode. So like, I'm going to try to alternate between Heroic Mode and uh, from Bronze to Epic every other day. So you guys can look forward to that. I'm going to show you guys some progression today. But before we get started... Uh, let's actually go ahead and accept some friends. There's actually 40 spaces I've left. Uh, got all of these people to accept, so I don't got any more space. Um, that really sucks. So yeah, I cannot do anything about that. Oh, speaking of space, by the way, if we go to the guild, I just want to show you guys, we got some space in the guild. If you guys want to go ahead and join in, I just want to let you guys know we are soon going to be rebuilding the guild. And that's going to be in December. And in December, we're going to be kicking out anybody that isn't an all-incognito member. And you have to reapply to join in. So that way you guys are warmed about that. Um, so that way you don't see me as a jerk that I'm kicking you out for no apparent reason. Hereby, you're warned. If you want to join in for the upcoming weeks and just have some fun, uh, we're not really aiming for anything specifically. Um, so, you know, you can go ahead and apply and just have some fun. And that way you guys can get to hang out with us. So, that being said, let's actually get the show on the road. And I am currently done on Flaming Wildwood. And I went to uh, Cold Rock Cracks. Which, uh, by the way, is a pretty, pretty tough stage already. So, last time I died here. Uh, which was uh, like a... Like an hour ago or a couple of hours ago. This is a Yeti. Um, that spear, um, I'm going to show you guys in slow motion a little bit later. That spear reminds me of something. Just like when I saw it. I was like, that reminds me of... Gosh, what was it? It was a spear in Maple Story. Um, like some of you guys know, I sometimes use Maple Story music in my videos. Um, the team song of Al Naf. And... Um, it's called the Fair Frozen. Go look it up. Go Google it. Fair Frozen. It's I think it's Fair Frozen. This spear, man, that looks really cool. Anyway, you're going to get a uh, special. Um, you're going to <coughs> you're going to be getting a uh, unmelting ice shard from these, and with these you can uh, actually craft the two star the glacier armor, which is pretty cool. So um, easy to get some crafting materials here for two stars. Going to be getting five. You usually don't even get this. I don't even think you need to be doing a special attack to uh, get some, um, get some, uh, uh, get some uh, of these materials over here. Okay, sixth stage, uh, stage number six, and this uh, this boss over here at the ending is actually the one from the um, arm of the bear, I believe. I'm not entirely sure, but it looks like a bear, at least from the from the hands. It looks like uh, it, it, it's these are bear claws. And uh, I like this. Uh, I like this epic boss. Like a combination between a tree, between a yeti, and a bear. But the special attack, unfortunately, is kind of disappointing. But what do you expect with the old epic boss? I was trying to do a special attack there, so that way we could actually get some materials. But that didn't really work out. And man, I'm so unlucky when it comes down to these star fragments, man. Like I'm trying all the time to get these star fragments, but I don't seem to be getting them. It really sucks. Um, maybe now if I if I do this one. Oh yeah, by the way, I got Wukong's Nemesis. That's also like a funny story. So, I logged into Knights and Dragons today, right? I had a Dark Prince uh, key uh, out of like one of the um, like one of the uh, stages. You you apparently get like fusion boost armors and, and stages uh, and keys if you finish up a stage like this. And I managed to get a Dark Prince skin. I was like, hey, I can actually open that up on screen. Maybe we're going to be getting like a cool little legendary. And then I opened up the game this morning and like freaking I got myself... Um, a, a the Wukong's nemesis and I was like how did I get that I thought like it was going to be a daily reward for logging in every single day but apparently it consumed my uh, dark prince key so I was like man that's such a scam um, kind of felt bad about it to be honest because I was really looking forward to showing it off to you guys but there will be different chances in the future I'm pretty sure about that so Currently, I'm on stage number four out of six, and um, I do really notice that the um, that that the stage's difficulty really does go up. Um, but once again, you know, it may it might be just me because I have so much issues getting these star fragments. Um, I see so many people getting like, "Hey, I got like five in a row without even uh, without even dying and stuff like that." I'm like, "Is it that my that my knights are so weak, or is it that I'm just really unlucky?" 
and die real fast or something like that. I have no idea. Like, I cannot figure it out. But you guys should let me know how you guys are doing currently on heroic mode. I'm really curious. I know some of you guys already finished. Um, for those of you guys who aren't, if, if you actually finished, I would like to know as well. Just let me know in general how, how you, well you guys are doing on the heroic mode. Uh, pretty curious about that. Um, by now, I believe, like, honestly... Oh, I got one. Awesome. Water fragment. So, uh, honestly, to you guys... Um, Right now, we're at like, uh, we're one week in-ish. And I would say, if you really want to make sure that you want to be getting in this epic, the plus version at least, then what you gotta be doing is, you already should be crafting the first epic by now. Because otherwise, um, you know for a fact that you're going to be getting a lot of trouble on Kingdom of Darkness, that's one thing for sure. Uh, what I could advise a lot of people to do actually, is by doing these stages with your normal knights and do Kingdom of Darkness with your friends every single day. And that way, you're pretty sure to get at least one fragment each day. And because of that, you're gonna be able to, uh, to work your way to Zephyr Plateau and then make, your, make it easier on yourself. And I don't know about you guys, that might be a, a tip that will help you out. Um, not entirely sure, but let's actually go ahead and see how well we're gonna be doing because we're about to level up And I actually want to be taking down kingdom of darkness for you guys So as you guys already see I applied on my own tactic uh, to my own knights in here So uh, pretty nice stuff. So um, a lot of people out there actually do have um, I don't know if there's one on the wiki, but uh, the the sort of layout that you should be using or the the um, Yeah, the sort of lineup that you should be using on heroic mode uh, on this one uh, because like it, it, these stages are just so much easier if you are actually actually having the knights to uh, to take down this these stages, you know. I'm gonna go with this one. <clears throat> I'm, I'm having so much trouble with my throat right now. I'm gonna try to preserve my voice a little bit here and there. Um, let me see. Let me see. Which one can we take? This one, white horse. That's pretty badass. Look at that armor. I don't even know which armor that is. I forgot. That sucks. Yeah, lately I don't really know what the epics are called. Because um, there's so many. There's so many new epics every single time. And I still remember up to like uh, Champions Battle Gear. What every everything was called. But after that I just like... I didn't really bother that much with epics I suppose. It wasn't really that... Um, that interested in the epics anymore. Because we... We kept getting new ones. I mean, I got the, the Wingstorm Battle Gear because obviously I got that one. But the moment I got it, I really had no idea what the name of that one was. The same thing with the um, uh, with with this armor over here. I think that's the... Uh, I have no idea even what, what that one is called. So I should do some research in what the armors are called because I, I'm catching a little bit behind there. Um, I have no idea. I'm just rambling right now because uh, I'm trying to make my time full here. I'm actually just going to wrap the episode up. After this one, because I really feel that my throat is kind of, it's kind of taking its toll on me. Oh, we leveled up. Oh, that's the whole purpose of doing this one right now. To level up and show you guys that we can actually take down this stage. It's going to be a really close call though. Um, I'm not entirely sure if I'm going to be able to take down the entire stage. But it's going to be pretty nice to see. So I'm in a huge disadvantage right now. Let's throw in a special attack here. And he's going to be doing like one fourth of the damage. And that's my main nightwear in this one. Okay. Gonna be doing about the same damage here too, but at least less of a weakness. Weak weakness weakness. There we go. Stage number four right now. I should be doing more special attacks, but I don't. Maybe this one. Is that a special one? I think it is, but for which armor? I'm not sure about that. Hey, there's a mosquito flying around here. You should die soon. I got a. Electric fly swatter over here that I'm going to be using um, Like sometimes I'm su I'm such a dork that I actually like when I'm smashing around especially at night Like when I'm trying to sleep and like a little mosquito comes near my ear. I get really crazy, right? Uh, because yeah, it's really it's a really annoying sound it's like zzz, like in your ear and then um, What I'm doing is I wake up I turn up the light and I get my electric fly swatter and I like swing around, but sometimes like I'm when I'm really like drowsy because I, I just like try to sleep. I hit myself with the electric fly swatter and then I cannot sleep anymore because I'm wide awake because of that. Uh, just like a funny little thing that I wanted to share with you guys just like cross my mind. Oh man, okay, we're almost there. This is the uh, the last epic boss over here. <clears throat> gonna try to take him. I think we're gonna be able to take him down. 
He doesn't do a lot of damage though. Oh man, he does do a lot of damage. No, no, no. No, 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 no. God damn it. <laughs> that really sucks. Oh man, that blows. Oh man. I'm gonna be having, I'm gonna have to do that one off screen. That really sucks. Yeah, I was gonna wrap up the episode anyway, so I'm just gonna leave it to that. I'm gonna be doing that tomorrow because I'm gonna take some chill time off. I wanna thank you guys so much for watching. I know this episode might have been a little bit boring, but I'm gonna be making sure that these episodes on the heroic mode, I'm gonna show you guys some highlights maybe from this point on forward or show you guys like every single stage, like a shorter episode than just like five minutes or something like that of heroic mode, show you guys every single boss. Uh, or whatever you I can show to you guys. I'm gonna try to get as far as I can. I mean, um, I'm I'm on like I'm on the one fourth of this entire heroic mode. I might even be able to get the epic plus, but it's going to be uh, pretty hard to get to it. But I'm gonna at least try. So that being said, though, once again, thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, make sure that if you guys like this video, to boom, give it a thumbs up. <clears throat> this uh, this bit reversal for the Ice Dragons. Oh my god. <laughs> I'll see you next time.